All right, guys, so this is just a quick setup overview for some of the solo episodes recently. So I've got my mic. This is what I use. Um, it's a USB-C, so it has the XLR, but it's got USB-C, and I can monitor here and uh, some quick controls here. Um, I use this on my computer. This is my work computer. So I use it there. So that's what the cable is here. It's run to the computer setup. It also hooks up to my MacBook, but when I'm recording something solo, I unplug it from there and plug it directly into my iPad and uh, just record on the iPad. It makes it a million times easier. And the app that I use is called Ferrite. I, it's not super cheap. I think it's like 30 bucks, but it's phenomenal. So I can go in, but I, if I wanted to, I can go in and this is what the editor looks like. And it's super easy to go in and crop out, you know, chunks of the audio, especially with the Apple Pencil. Um, we can do quick edits like this and it just makes everything easier. But I've gotten really used to it. You can see the, the mic is not connected right now. So it's just using my iPad microphone. Um, but I typically, plug headphones in, plug this into the iPad. I'll do all my recording. And then once I'm done, I will disconnect the mic and everything and I'll just throw my AirPods in and I'll edit that way. Um, but this is really convenient for like, again, solo episodes, nothing, nothing too uh, <laughs> complicated. But I really, I've enjoyed the setup lately. Um, there is a free version of Ferrite and I think it limits you to like 10 minutes which was great because I, I actually downloaded uh, some files, dropped them in here and did like sort of a sample edit for the first few minutes just to check on it. And it worked really, really well. So yeah, that's, that's the setup for solo episodes. Um, super easy. Uh, the mic is great. I'll, I'll try to link everything, but it's a really great way to record keep everything in one you know, place. Uh, and then on the iPad, now that I've saved it to my iPad, I can go in and uh, I can log on to my host, upload the audio, fill out all the details and schedule it to drop. So super convenient, very easy to use. And well, the editor takes a little bit of getting used to, especially if you're using an Apple Pencil because you got to learn some of the shortcuts and gestures and things like that. But for the most part, like uh, I've only, I've done two or three episodes on here and I feel like we've gotten the hang of it. It's got some really great automation where you can trim out silences and stuff like that. You can set the minimum threshold. You can tell it to fade in and out of, of cuts and all of that stuff. So works really nicely. Not cheap, 30 bucks for an app. But again, for, for what you're getting, I, I feel like that's pretty good. And I'm not, I'm not upset with it. Anyways, that's the update. Just recorded a fresh uh, episode for you guys. And uh, I'll have it up very, very soon. Yeah. Thanks. Have a good one. Peace.